vice Kenyans. And the danger that is ahead is more than you can imagine. The government is broke. And is broke beyond your imagination. I do not recall a time when we have had few shortages. And no matter what stories you are being told, the problem is money. The problem is money. This government has run the country to the ground. That is the legacy of Uhuru Muigai Kenyatta. Economically, you have run us to the ground and beyond. That is the legacy that we will remember you for. And we want to tell you, it is now Itweka. The time, your time is over, and all that you represent is now over. It is Itweka. Itweka, Itweka, Itweka. Your time is up, and all that you represent, all that think like you, all that believe that governing, you are a king. You're, there's no kings here. We are all equal under the eyes of God. And this is now the time for us as leaders to give back to the people. Put on our hard hats, sweat, and make sure that the Kenyan that you see every day in your life is living a life even better than yours. That is what we are here for. That is what God has put us here for. With the little that we have, make sure that the world you live is better than you have found it. Uhuru Mwegai Kenyatta, you are living in Kenya worse than you found it under Mwai Kibaki. Mwai Kibaki, when he left office, 38 of 100 Kenyans did not have food every night. Today, and I can tell you this, within four years, by the time we hit 2018, 53 of 100 Kenyans could not put food in their mouths at night. That is the case today. It has not improved. There's no way you are going to lift a hungry people. If we cannot feed ourselves, we are never going to be great. We were supposed to be great. We are not. We must be great, and that time is now. We have no time to wait. We have no time for experiments. The leadership that has been there has been there for far too long. Too long. It is now an a moment on all of you. Your time has now all come up to an end. All my friends who are competing with me, and there are not many, I think there are only two. They have been there for more than 30 years. Their time is also up. This is now time for fresh leadership, different thinking, progressive thinking. People who see Kenyans as they see themselves, we are all equal under the eyes of God. There's nobody more better than the other. God gives us all gifts, all of us. The best thing that a leader can do is to harness all those gifts together and produce greatly for all of us. That is what we're about. That is what Safina is about. That is what Jimmy Wanjigi is about. Itweka time is here. Itweka, itweka, asante ni sana. I abhor political intolerance. I myself have been a victim. Up until very recently, I was in ODM the first party I joined. And ODM showed me at Kasarani that political intolerance. Organized by their own Secretary General, a few goons decided to throw stones on me. That political intolerance then was not, was not challenged or even talked about by the leadership of ODM. It is very sad what I saw happening to Raila Odinga. I think this is not a country. I think we've matured. I think our politics is more mature than that. It is terrible what we saw, and I condemn it. And I condemn it anywhere in this country. If you don't want to listen to somebody, you know, just don't appear. But if somebody appears as a leader to try and talk for votes, give them the chance to speak, they may even, you may learn something. So I, am, I abhor political intolerance, and I condemn the incidences that have happened. Anything else? Thank you very much. Kikuyu, you, you know, I'm trying to do, I'm trying to avoid Nyodwa, 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 you know, we are doing national. No, Tureka, Swahili. Eta niseme, niseme, niseme kwa Kiswahili. Nimekuja hii kanisa, kwa sababu, nikuwa hapa Oktoba, kashauriana na, na wachungaji wa hii kanisa, 
eh, mwendao bishopu walikuwa na taka gari na kusema ni kutenda nilisema wakati huo nitaleta huo gari na miezi sita imefika tumeleta hiyo gari leo tumekuwa anointed na hii kanisa na tunashukuru kabisa baraka ambao wametupatia leo ni za, ni za mweze Mungu na hizo nakwambia tutatenda kabisa kwa wananchi wa Kenya nataka kuzumzia rafiki yangu uhuru mwegai kenyata 